Welcome back to the Cutting Room Boutique. Join Lynn as she introduces her favorite outfits of the fall season. Hi everyone. It's uh, two days till the official start of fall and we certainly have fall clothes to show you. So we're really happy to be back. Eileen is not here today because her daughter is getting married this weekend. So she has a few Mother of the Bride things to do, but she'll be back uh, soon in the future. So I have, this is one of the outfits that I loved when I came back to work um, this week. I'm going to uh, deconstruct myself. This is a great bag. Look at the way it sits on your hip. I just love it. It's uh, pure leather. It's quite deep. So you can get a lot in this. I always have a pet peeve about not being able to get my glasses and sunglasses in some of these smaller bags, but this one I think you definitely could, plus your phone and your wallet. It's a lovely bag. And these new guitar straps, this is your accent piece. You don't need much jewelry because this is the accent piece. So have a look. We also have it in a beige color. I'll take that off. I'll give that to you, Bridget. This sweater and scarf is by Renoir, sold separately. It has a little bit of bling on the scarf and on the bottom of the sweater. Not too much, but a little bit. I think this scarf is gorgeous. How many things would you wear this with in your closet? And you want things that you can wear many in many different outfits, I know. So I'll take that off and here's the sweater. Just a simple crew neck lovely soft fabric. Now, do you like my black blouse that I put under it for accent? Because I wanted to pull in my black shoes and the black bag that I was wearing. This is a dicky. They are back. And now you don't have the bulk of a blouse underneath, the weight or the heat of a blouse, but look at the look it gives it. I'm going to take it off for you and show you the difference. You can get two different looks. The way, and I have a little trick for you, the way you keep this in place is you just tuck the front of it into your bra cups and it will stay in place. So it just looks like this. They're cotton. We have three, black, white, and a chambray. All right, so you see the difference with just your plain neckline. I'm wearing the Joseph Rubkop pants, beautiful pants, high-waisted, Love the high waist on them, the pockets in the front. These are heavy enough that in our climate, I'm going to wear them all year round. They're a size eight. This is a medium. I would wear the small, but it was up on the wall. And the dicky is a one size. Okay. I didn't have to change my pants. Versatility of a nice pair of khaki pants, right? This is, um, these are two pieces that I think really look smashing together. The sweater vest is a big trend. It was big last year, and we have about four of them at least here in the store. I love every one of them. This gorgeous color is one of the hot colors for fall, kind of a burgundy, um, a dark Cabernet color. This is by Tribal. Big slits on the side, high neck, of course, nice big arms because you're gonna wear something under it. And we love this blouse uh, with it. Bridget and Sandy suggested, I think it's great. This is by Charlie B. Beautiful plaid, kind of an ombre feel. The fabric is acrylic, polyester, and a little spandex, and it is really soft. No scratchy polyester feel at all to it. It's a lovely shirt. And if you wanted to wear it by itself with jeans, because this also goes to denim, it's a really good scarf, uh, shirt that you could you know, do lots of different things with the bottom. But under this, I just want it straight. But isn't the, and look at this is high-low, this vest. So this is Tribal, Charlie B, and Ripkoff. Having a lot of fun trying on all these beautiful things. I forgot to mention the jewelry that I wore on the last piece, and it goes beautifully with this outfit, so I can do it. This is a um, Ziska piece and it's reversible. So I'm choosing it to wear it on the plain side, but earlier I wore it with the gold. This has no uh, metal of any kind and it is adjustable. So you could bring it high in your neckline or low. Ziska makes beautiful pieces of jewelry out of resin, I think they are. Mm -hmm. Now, 
How about this blazer? If you are looking for a great modern blazer and you don't want another bomber jacket or biker jacket style, look at the length of this. Perfect as a blazer, is it not? Absolutely. And it is the most gorgeous color of chocolate brown I think I've ever seen. It is just beautiful. It's a faux suede, zippers up all the way up. I don't know why you'd ever would do Actually, that. Actually, it doesn't zipper. It oh. works just like the Moto jackets. It has that zipper, but it oh, it's just it for just has the clip right there at, at your waist. Oh, I see. Let me see. Yes, yeah, so there's a little snap right here if you wanted to pull it over. The um, pockets. I don't know if they're real. But yes, they are real pockets on the side. It's a gorgeous. This is by Charlie B. Mm -hmm. And. Uh, fit the style I just love it now we have a terrific blouse by Nick and Zoe which is 80% recycled polyester and uh, it feels wonderful on it snaps all the way down not buttons and a one snap here on the cuff so that you can get that nice pleated look and it stays tight on your arm the way you want it the collar I think it's a beautiful blouse the buttons stop here, so it's a placard. And I just tucked it in here in the front to wear with that blazer, but here it is in the back, and you can see um, that it was under that blazer just fine. So if you want a long look, you wanted to belt this, would be beautiful. We also have the blouse in black. We have it in black, the black is beautiful. And Bridget, hand me the other. This is the same beautiful chocolate brown in a Ripkoff, the traditional biker jacket. It is, has faux suede at the front and the pleather or artificial leather on the arms. So it's also a very nice option, depending on the length perhaps that you would like in a blazer. Okay, and the pants. These are from Renoir. They're a nice techno fabric. They have lots of stretch in them. They are tr a traditional pull-up. See the stretch? Love the uh, check. There's a little of the rust color in it. You could even get away with the cranberry top that I wore earlier. It has brown and black and a cream base. Really a nice pair of pants. And those have a tummy control panel. Oh, good. Well, we all love that. I read somewhere recently that every woman has issues with their tummy. Regardless of how thin they are, they still have tummy issues. And just a tip here, these pants are long on me but I wanted to show you the difference when you don't have the um, length of your leg right. This looks sloppy, does it not? And you see people just wearing them like this. If you turn them up, show a little ankle. I would even do this a little higher perhaps on me. Just kind of like the ankle showing, the skin showing, it makes your leg look longer. And I think that's a much more tailored look. Very easy fix. These are easy to hem. They fit really nicely. Love these. I think you could wear, bought this pants with six tops at least you would wear with. We reduce one of our pleather pieces or artificial leather. This is a vest by um, Nick and Zoe. It is so soft. Really, it's lovely. I'm wearing a size eight, I believe, um, and I'm wearing an underpinning of my own. I'm sure many of you ladies have just a long sleeve black t-shirt, a lightweight black cardigan. You <coughs> could wear white or cream also to cover the arms and maybe white or cream would even be great because it would highlight this piece better. But it's a beautiful design. Look at how it's gathered here in the front. Fitted to the waist. And we pulled a piece of jewelry that pulls in the rust that's in the pants to wear. I think it's a beautiful piece, really a statement piece. And ladies, this is machine washable. Can you believe it? Turn it inside out, do it on gentle cycle, don't bleach it or anything obviously, and just hang it to dry. We have pants, skirts, and a dress in this pleather or artificial leather fabric. So come and see them. All right, another pleather artificial leather piece from Nick and Zoe. Now, when you first look at this, you think, oh, this is too short, I'll never wear it. All you do is wear your tights. 
and now it looks fantastic. Look how good it looks with the chunky boot uh, loafers that are in style. A couple other suggestions. This is a new shoe brand that we've gotten. Gabor. 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 It is a German company, beautiful make. I love these. We've sold a lot of them already because it gives you a good inch, inch and a half in height. And since we're all losing height, this is nice if you can put some in your shoes. But look how great these would look with them. Combat boots are still very much in style. This would look great with this too. So you have lots of foot options. Little booty would be great as well. I'll show it to you in a little more detail. I like to tuck it in the front. It has a, a traditional zipper and a nice snap here. Two, two real pockets here right in the front, not on your hips to add any weight. There's no pleat in the back, is there, Bridget? Uh, there are. There, there are pleats in the back? Just down the side of your, uh, there may be not pleats, but seams. Oh, the seams down Down the each leg. Right. This fabric is so soft. I mean, you're just gonna wanna be feeling yourself touch, touch all, yourself day, all day, day long. long. <laughs> it's so nice. I just love how this looks with the tights. Love it. And the sweater, also by Nick and Zoe, is beautiful. It has the little uh, rust colored trim and on the bottom as well. Does it, Bridget? Or just uh, on the sleeves? I think it's just on the sleeves. So this Ziska piece, now you've seen me wear it on three different outfits. That's the kind of jewelry you want, right? You don't want it just for one outfit. It picks up this color beautifully. I'll pull it out and show you the full length of it. You can see the difference between tucking or not tucking. You want to do a side tuck. Gives it a different look. Very modern when you do this tuck. Love this skirt. Fantastic. Thank you, Lynn, for another great video. We hope you will join us for our next video. We hope to see you soon.